there. When the process of uh, of getting this bike fixed first started. Let's see how we go. Okay, you ready? And I took the bike down to Nick at uh, NV Motorcycles. And there's, there's a girl oh, sitting yeah. there. Gorgeous. Down in Morrinsville. One on each corner, almost. I was talking to Vicky. She needed to get all the service record for the bike. And of course, I didn't buy it brand new. And so when it hit the 10,000 kilometre mark, I did the service myself. Changed the oil and filter, and Vicky was saying to me, um, I can't seem to find the, the service record for the 10,000. I said, No, that's because I did that service myself, it was out of factory warranty. So, you know, I like to do as much work as I can on my vehicles myself. And she said, Oh, <laughs> and I could hear the change of tone in her voice. So I said, Is that going to be a problem? She said, Well, it might be. Motor Guzzi will want to see a, um, a proper service record. Oh dear, I thought. Um, and I said to her, well I did buy the, the, the correct grade of oil and the filter from a Motor Guzzi dealer up in Auckland. She said, oh that's good, that'll help. Have you got the receipts? I said, I don't think so, but I can talk to them. So anyway, I went back to the dealer that I bought the, the oil and that from and um, because I had an account with them they were able to go back and have a look and sure enough yep here it is they said so they sent me uh, a copy of the receipt so anyway five minutes later it popped up in my email and they sent me the, the receipt so that oil change very nearly cost me three thousand dollars <laughs> because if, if i hadn't been able to prove that i'd used the correct oil and uh, filter motor guzzy possibly probably most likely wouldn't have agreed to front for the parts because they couldn't be sure that the um, the bike had been serviced correctly